but I need that key. So what do we do? There is another way in, it looks like. Okay. Dude left. No fair. No fair. <clears throat> Alright, so where do we use this key now? That is the question. Get these secret documents first. September 19th, good day. <laughs> really? I fucking quit. Flesh eating bacteria? Wow, okay. You can just stay there, buddy. That's fine by me. Here we go. Oh, never mind. That's not the. Oh, jeez. He has no nose or mouth. That's that's really spooky. <coughs> Where are we going? 
going here? Where are we going? Through here? Yeah, it's gotta be. Some dude praying. I'm hearing an organ. Is it the Ganondorf fight? Are we going up against Daddy Dorf? One thing I'd like to point out is that way too many people do not wash their hands. Especially if you go to Japan. <laughs> but I can't tell you how many times I've been at work and just been sitting on the toilet. And people will come in and out. And you can hear that they never use the sink or wash their hands or do anything. It's pretty gross. Whoa! Dude, this area is crazy. Yeah, most of the toilets in Japan do have the bidet feature where they spray the bottom of your butt, but I never used it, of course, so I'm not into that. God hates sickness. God hates money. Oh my god. Dude, love? What are you guys doing here? No way! You guys came for my initiation. My job. You alone shall escape the Talva. This is your penultimate act of witness. The promise of the prophets was always freedom from death. And, and here it is. You will watch and record. My resurrection, and together we will be free. I don't think it's gonna work, buddy. You are no longer in any danger. I fixed the elevator. It will take you to freedom. We will all of us be free. Thou, my son. Chase.
bring it. what I did in Dirt Fighter. <laughs> that was the point though, I was just having fun with it. We're not trying hard here, we're not trying hard. I think he just rips out my heart, I think that's what happens. I think he's right outside the door. I think he went in the wrong door. No he didn't! outmaneuver this guy. Let's just try going into the first room. Shit. Didn't mean to do that at all. Okay, no, that was an arm. He definitely ripped off an arm. He definitely ripped off an arm that time. <laughs> so I just need to go down that route. We just need to go down that route. Pretty sure. <laughs> Ultimate noob, the camera breaks when you drop it. Oh, Jesus, there he is. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. There's nobody in here. There's nothing. There's nobody in here. How do we get to the elevator? That's what I want to know. And what's the point of this section? That's a shame. I, uh, am I stuck? 
Can I not get out of here? Oh, here we go. Finally. Okay. There we go. There's the elevator. Resident Evil, oh my god. We're going down into the underground laboratory. Oh boy. Final stretch, my butt. You guys have said final stretch like a million times. <laughs> the two hour projection was way off. I joke, I joke. Dun, uh, Frankenstein, the modern Prometheus. Wow. <laughs> you guys are hilarious. Oh, Jesus. No, this way? Okay, this way. Oh, there's a camera. Where's the battery then? There should be a battery if there's a camera. Not a single battery in this entire laboratory. Give me a break. I don't need your pills. Grab it, peel. I don't need any of that. Fourteenth autopsy. Major sperm protein. Okay. Look at those dual heads. They need to just stop making zombies. That's the real thing. When has this ever been a good idea? Is that freedom? Are we on Mars? Is this Mars? Or is this like a desert? <laughs> it could be it could be Mars. No, that's pretty funny though. We found the algorithm. Oh jeez, I missed so many notes. I'm not the only victim here, not by a long shot. I watch a man wait to burn to death, the most painful death imaginable rather than stay in this place. God help me. I think I've seen the wall rider. I can't believe Father Martin won up Jesus Christ, Jesus Christ himself in shitty ways to die. And I don't believe I'm gonna miss him. A way out. If he's telling the truth, now I've got a way out. And a story to tell. He wants me to spread his gospel. I'll tell the whole fucking world. Fuck, 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 fuck. Whoever finds my corpse, trust no one and tell everyone. I am not crazy. I know, I know. Only crazy people say that. But I am as sane as this world allows. <laughs> okay. Don't call it a gospel. Call it a mockery of reason. Let the world know it is Murkoff's fault. 
Umbrella. Give me a hacksaw and a few hours alone with Dr. Wernicke's corpse. I feel I owe him a debt. Sweet algorithm, bro. I do have to commend this journalist for always keeping that camera up whenever duty calls. He's a bona fide journalist. Okay, no, we definitely don't go that way. So I guess this is a man in sleep paralysis, and that's Mara sucking the nipples. Is that what's going on there? You have to stop him to murder Billy. Turn off his life support, his anesthesia. You have to undo what I've done. No one Nanomachines. You must kill him. Kill Billy? But Billy's just a boy. What 
about you, old man. Quick, pull the fire alarm. I don't care. See ya. Don't care, don't care. Alright, where are we going? Not the cafeteria. Not the bathroom. Okay, you know what? I guess this has to be it then. Because they just locked me in. No? Okay. I like the cafeteria. I want to hang out here in the cafeteria. Get some cola! Drink it! Surely we can block him with the door, right? We can do that, right? have no clip. So I guess I just turn right when I get to the top of the stairs. I hate that crap, man. One wrong turn and it's over.
so where's the valve? stadium to keep one lunatic alive fuck it all break it all he has to die just because that doctor that I want to kill too told me so I think we're okay, right guys? I think we're making progress. Chasing us, I don't even know what's happening. 
my hand on a thing. I didn't see the thing. I don't I don't need to see Billy, I just need to run from Billy. I can't fight Billy. So what's the point? Uh, oh god! our hand on Billy's fight stick? Okay. Billy. So where's the main console? That doesn't help me. <laughs> I don't know where the main console is. He's got a bunch of coins. Bite me? 
out. That's a good objective. Damn, look what happened to Billy. Poor feller. Billy is dead. The wall rider, the swarm, whatever it is, I'm made with him. Whether I escape or die here, I am free. Alright, now where am I going? Up there? Okay. Oh my god. Billy definitely got bodied. You, can, you can't stop me. Understand. This is why I didn't want to pursue that career because the whole world of journalism has just gotten so effed up. It, it's pretty much just like this game now. Oh, jeez. Did we get, like, possessed by Billy? Is that what happened? <laughs> I think Billy possessed us. This is about ethics and game journalism. Oh, no. Is that how it ends? Saw that coming. Goddammit. You have become the host. Yep. Good ending, good ending. <laughs> good stuff. Well, we made it through. We made it through. We did it, guys. We made it through our first spooby game. Brand new play of Outlast. I hope you guys enjoyed that. I am definitely the host. <laughs> I am the host. With special guest Billy. It's a good ending. As soon as the uh, old doctor tells you to kill the dude, you know that he's got something else up his sleeve still. He's still watching you. So that was pretty awesome. <laughs> Whoops. Well, we could just skip it so we could talk. Thanks again, guys, for tuning in on this blind play of Outlast. I had a lot of fun with it. I hope you did too. Very tense game. Very good game, though. Very atmospheric. Very spooky. We have to raise our spook count, though. <clears throat> I think in the end, our total spook count should be right here. 42. This is the answer. This is the answer right here. 42. 